Hey you guys, welcome back for another day of our January daily challenge. For this 10 minute workout, we've got an AMRAP. That means as many rounds as possible. So we've got five exercises. For each exercise, we're gonna do five reps. We're gonna keep moving through those five exercises for five total minutes, so lots of fives today. And then we've got 30 seconds rest, one more time through for another five minutes. So we're hit our 10 total minutes of work. For those five exercises, we've got five squats, same as we always do them, feet a little wider than shoulder width apart, toes point forward, sit those hips back, keep that chest nice and tall. When we sit those hips back into that squat, making sure those knees point the same direction as those toes, but aren't going out in front of them. So you back over those ankles. As always, if you wanna take that up in intensity, you can add a little hop. We've got our jump squat as an option or our tap squat as another option for that increased intensity. Second one is gonna be our five burpees. Now our burpees, we've also got a lot of options. For our first one, we've got a hop or a to the toes. Higher impact option, hop it up. Lower impact option to those toes. From there, we bring it down, hands meet the mat. We can hop out and hop in. We can step out and step in. Or we can do half and half. So step out, hop in, or hop out, step in. Taking your option there, keeping it moving through those five. Third option, or third exercise that we've got is gonna be our five mountain climbers. Now we're gonna do five each. So let's make that 10 mountain climbers, just to make sure that we're not confused, five each leg. We're in that plank position right from that burpee. You can step one, two, three, up to 10, or you can jog one, two, three, four, five, up to 10 mountain climbers. From there, we're keeping it low, five push-ups. Toes or knees, full range of motion wherever you are. So if you can hit that full range of motion, from those toes, down, exhale to press up. Knees is next option, down, exhale to press up. If you still can't quite hit that full range of motion, walk those knees in a little bit so that they're a little bit closer to under those hips. And then we're taking the chest down and back up. So we're reducing that lever, we're reducing the space between the hands and the knees. Five push-ups. From there, we're taking it all the way down to the floor, out long, five super mats. First option for a little bit lower intensity, if you've got any lower back pain, those feet stay down, we just lift the upper body, those arms and those shoulders and that head and bring it back down for five. Second option, higher intensity, we take it up all the way, toes and hands, and then back down to that mat for our five. From there, once we've finished all five of those exercises, take it back to the top, bring it back up for our five squats. Like I said, five minutes, keep it moving all the way through that, and then we'll have our 30 seconds rest, and another five minutes. Let's get started with just a quick, easy four move warm up before we get going. Take those feet a little wider than shoulder width apart, sinking those hips side to side. And I will keep those moves up on the screen the whole time. So this is a self-paced workout. If you're moving a little faster or slower than me, the moves will be up here the whole entire time. You'll just get to glance up and see what's coming next if you're not moving quite at the same pace as my demonstrations are. From here, let's take it to a knee pull. Knee coming up and in. Two more movements, we've got an upper body. So we're gonna start off that upper body, opposite arm goes up and down, a little bit of a diagonal, open it up through the chest, pulling the shoulder blades together. Awesome job, you guys. And just to get that heart rate up a little bit, our fourth and final warm-up move, it's gonna be jumping jacks or step jacks. So our jumping jacks right here, or our step jacks, a little lower intensity, side to side. 10 more seconds, just like this. Keep them moving for five, four, three, two, and one. Awesome. All right, so like I said, moves will be up here the whole time. We've got five full minutes, 30 seconds rest, five more full minutes. Getting ready to get started with our squat in five, four, three, two, one, here we go. Starting off with those five squats again, you can add that hop if you'd like to. If you want that lower intensity, lower impact, keeping it nice and slow and controlled, over to those five burpees, here we go. Hop if you'd like to. You can hop out and hop in or step out and step in. Take your option that works best for you, maybe you change it up as we go. Like I said, this is a self-paced workout, so if you're moving a little faster or slower than me, that's okay. Keep it moving. Down for those mountain climbers. 10 total, five each leg. 
When you finish those, bring it down for our push-ups. Modify if you need to. Like I said, that exhale presses us up from their supermans. Feet can stay down if they need to. A little less intensity on that lower back. When you finish those five, bring it back up. We're taking it to the top for those squats. We're already past a minute in of our five. Keep it moving. When you finish those squats, we're into those burpees. Burpees, we're taking it for those mountain climbers. So bring it right down to that plank position. 10. To push ups. To Supermans. One, keep working, keep going. Here we go, you guys. We're already two minutes in. About a minute per round. We're aiming for that five rounds if we can. Keep moving, keep moving, keep breathing. Keep that pace up. Taking it between those exercises. Like I said, self-paced. So if you're going a little faster or slower, we keep and count. Five of each. Nice, easy number to remember. Said it enough times today. Keeping it going. Less than two minutes left, you guys. Keep going, keep going. Here we go, here we go. Down for those mountains. Ten of those, then we got push-ups. Keep working. Keep breathing. Push-ups to supermans. Here we go, here we go. A couple more minutes left. We're almost there. One final minute. Keep moving, keep moving. Finishing out at least a final round here. Got a nice break after this. Keep working. Take those modifications if you need to at any point. Bring it down for our mountain climbers after our burpees. Superman's almost there. We've got 15 seconds left. Finish out this round. Make every last rep count. 10 seconds. Bring it up for squats. We're here for three, two, and one. Way to work. 30 second break. Grab a drink. Take a moment. And then we'll get ready to get going once again. We've just got five more minutes of work. We've got one more time through with those same exercises. Once again, just kind of keeping it moving, keeping it going the whole five minutes, self-paced. So if you need a little bit of a break, you take a little bit of a break. If you need to work a little bit harder, you move a little bit faster. Getting ready to get going once again. We've got our five exercises, five reps of each, 10 of those mountain climbers. So make sure you hit five on each leg. We're starting off with those squats in three, two, one, 
again. Here we go. Five minutes. Five squats. Over to those burpees. From burpees, we've got mountain climbers. Takes us to push ups. Full range of motion on those push ups. Push ups takes us to Superman's. Here we go. After your Superman's, we're bringing it back up, back to the top for squats. We're about a minute in. Squats takes us to burpees. Burpees takes us to mountain climbers. To push ups. To Superman's. Nice work, you guys. Keep moving, keep going. You guys are doing awesome. Finishing out strong. Here we go, here we go. As always, moving at that own pace. So wherever you need to be. Need to move a little faster or slower, that's okay. All right, here we go, you guys. Finishing strong. Three, four. With this second set of five minutes, 10 minute workout. We're almost to completion here. Keep breathing, keep getting that full range of motion. minutes left here. About a minute 45. Two, three, four, five. Keep working. Keep working. You guys got this. Stay after it. Minute and a half. Here we go. Keep moving. Keep moving. Burpees to mountain climbers, mountain climbers to push ups, push ups to Superman's. Way to work. You guys got this. There's less than a minute. We've got 45 seconds left. Here we go. Finishing out strong, making every single last one of these reps count. Making this last time through our best, fullest range of motion. 30 final seconds. Keep moving, keep moving. You guys got this. Here we go. 20 seconds. Finish strong, finish strong. Less than 10. We got five, four, three, two, and one. Taking a moment, catching your breath, 
We're meeting standing for our cool down, real quick and easy. When you get to standing, we're gonna start with some shoulder rolls. Whew. Loosen them up from those mountain climbers, burpees, push-ups, and supermans. Make sure you take that second direction if you're hitting one direction. A little more shoulders, let's take that right arm across the chest. Left arm comes across the chest. Let's hit triceps real quick, right arm over the head. Left arm over the head. Let's take it to a lateral stretch for that core. Take it up over top, nice big stretch. Maybe you grab that opposite wrist with that opposite hand. Bring it through center, same thing, second side. Bring it back to center, circle it around. Hamstrings and quads, Zoe got left, hamstrings, foot out, toe up, fingertips down towards that toe. We're hinging at the hips, opposite knee is bent. Switch it up. Finish out with quads. If you've got a wall or something to grab onto for that balance, pull that foot up behind, knee towards the ground. Switch it up, same thing, other leg. And go ahead and bring it down. Awesome work today. Thank you so much for joining me for today's daily challenge. You guys did great. I hope to see you guys tomorrow for another 10 minutes of hard work.